everybody. It's Michelle here with Angel Souls, and this is our daily angelic inspiration card reading. I'm okay. We're going to be all right. For June 24th, 2023, if you want to check out the offerings I have, always check out the description box. You can get on the community tab on my YouTube channel. I post a lot of updates there. All right. Let's see what we've got going on. Red. Interesting, because yesterday we had magenta, and it's a very similar kind of card. Very similar. Red. Free yourself from paying the numbers, too. Ugh. Go watch the weekly, the dailies. You're not going to believe it, okay? There's this big, this is like root chakra. Grounding. I know, I'm not like being too dramatic here. Grounding. How do I feel safe? What does it make me feel safe? How can I be more balanced? I can't keep saying this. <laughs> it's just, it's come up in every reading to be balanced and grounded. There you go. All right. But this says free yourself from pain. So this takes on a little different thing, right? So if something, something, I just got this feeling like breakups, that just hit me really hard. Um, some people are luckily getting themselves out of very bad situations. My love to you. Others are going, why am I putting up with this? If I, if you're, God forbid, with a partner who just thinks the world centers around them, uh, I actually know somebody who cheated on her husband. Her parents encouraged her to do this. I kid you not. There was a certain story that was out in the news that was pretty popular about parents just kind of blindly backing up their son and it just seemed like the whole family was a little psycho. It was sort of that, okay? Not, not to that extent, but a little bit of that. Anyway, this person was having an affair on her husband, but she had beat her husband down so badly and was so manipulative that he stayed. She had made disparaging remarks about her son, which is sadder than you know. How, why did I, why do I have to do this? Why do I have, oh. so this might be that kind of thing. Like if you know somebody like that, their partner may wake up and say, I'm out of here. And that son that you see as a burden is coming with me. You're freeing yourself from the pain. You're freeing yourself from this horrible cycle. Now, please understand these are general readings on the internet. This is not to give you any sort of advice about what you should do in your own personal situation. Everything's a free will choice. But the energy is here of a great awakening. And it's not necessarily like, oh, I knew I had psychic powers. So what? <laughs> I have psychic powers too. You don't see me stand out on the street going, this is why I'm better than you. You know, I don't do that, okay? But this is more of, like I said, self-discovery. Why am I allowing this? And um, could there be something more meaningful out there? Okay. A lot of egos are going to be wounded. And I think part of where the message in the weekly, if you go back and watch that, was to protect ourselves and stay grounded. I think because a lot of us are cracking open and realizing, okay, that's not how I want to be. And I'm fed up with this. The people who function from a dark place are going to get rattled because now they're not, now they have no control anymore. People have woken up, but they're educating themselves, right? So we call these personality disorders, but there's a spiritual thing behind it as well. And I keep calling them dark energies. There's a lot behind it, okay? We're realizing it. We're not taking it anymore. We're not taking the abuse. And so they're going to try to fight back. But don't be scared because go back and look at all the dailies. <laughs> go back and look at them. They're beautiful. It's, I realize I have the power. I always had the power. And I didn't deserve that treatment. I don't need to keep going through this. And uh, even if somebody gets mad and tries to ruin your reputation or goes on a smear campaign, all you have to do is show up, be authentically you, and prove them wrong. You don't need to even talk about it. Just be. All right. So we're going to leave it there. I'm sending you all so much love and take care.